Hey everyone, Markeisha here and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I wanted to talk about my Coach Bandit crossbody and it's in the color Sun Orange. So I actually had been looking at this bag for a while and I decided to go ahead and order it. Now I've had this bag maybe since March and I've worn it once. Yes, once. But that's not intentionally. It's just that I've only worn it once because I've had other bags I've been wearing. And this bag, as you can see, is on the smaller side. But anywho, let's go ahead and get into the review for this bag. So this is the Coach Bandit in the color Sun Orange. And I thought I had the tags in here, but I think I left them out. Let me just check really quick. I don't have the tag in here. But I believe this bag is $350. And Coach does currently have this bag on sale for, I think, $250 for their summer sale. They don't have this particular color, but they do have this bag style. And oh man, I absolutely love this bag. Coach did one when it made the Coach Bandit. And I wish this bag would become like a classic, like the Tabby and the Cassie. Um, I don't know if a lot of people like have this bag. I feel like the hype around this bag isn't as big, but it definitely should be. So this bag comes with the brass tone hardware, and then it has the hooks at the top, and I'll show you how the strap goes through there. It also has the coach horse and carriage tag right here i think that is so beautiful i love that they put it right here it has a back pocket i rarely use the back pocket of my handbags but it does have that in case you are a back pocket type of person and then this is how you open the bag so there's not nothing you really like press or anything you just like kind of open it this like hooks into here so you just open it like that. And when you open it, it says genuine full grain leather with the coach engraving. And if you don't know how I feel about coach engraving, I just absolutely love it. Um, so you open the bag here. It's like um, one pocket right here. You can put things. And then there's a big open compartment right here. There's also a magne magnetic pocket right here where the closure is magnetic. Um, and then there is a pocket in the back. So you have one, the open compartment, two, and then you have three, this front pocket, and then four, the back pocket. So looking at the bottom, there are no feet, but I'm okay with there not being any feet. This is a crossbody bag, so I don't necessarily feel like it needs feet, but I do like feet on bags, but this bag doesn't need it. Um, looking at the stitching and everything, it's just really beautiful. And I feel like the camera is picking up the true color. This is sun orange, but it's not like a bright orange and it's not like a muted orange. I feel like it's perfect for year round. And this is why I got this bag in this particular color because I did want a pop of color, but I didn't want anything that was gonna be too drastic and out of the way with my wardrobe. My wardrobe is primarily neutrals. Um, I would say 95% and then I'll incorporate like a color depending on the time of the year. So I love that I could wear this with my wardrobe and it not be too out of my element. So the top, I know you're probably wondering like, okay, how do you hook things on that? So I do have the strap in my hand and I'm going to show you how you put the strap on this bag. So this is a strap and it's basically like a belt, <laughs> like, but it is a strap. So it does have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven holes. And I typically put mine like on the second or third. So mine is on the second because um, as you're gonna see the particular strap drop. So all you're gonna do is just unhook it like so. So it's just like one long part. I'm gonna get my bag here and just put it through the top 
right here. So it's through the top like this. Then I'm just going to fasten it like a belt. And as you can see, oops, this is the bag. You can also do a shoulder bag and I think you just like do this and then it'll turn into a shoulder bag. But I don't like how that looks, like the strap, so I probably will never wear it like that. I plan on getting just like a gold chain, maybe this length, to wear as a shoulder bag. Because I, I did see a gentleman on his channel who reviewed this bag. He did that. But if you wanted to, you can definitely double it like, like so. But like this for a crossbody bag. So... And looking at the strap, Coach does have the engraving on the strap as well. I just love those subtle little details that Coach does. I think it's just huh, something about that that just makes it worthwhile. Let me just pull this little piece on here. And there we go. So you probably can see from the leather. That's just like from my handprints being on it. That's with this type of leather. Like you just have to wipe it down. It's just when I used this bag, I didn't wipe it down last time. So um, I just put it back in the dust bag. But I probably do need to go over it with like some type of cloth. Just to kind of get those handprints and just for my hands being all over it out of the bag. I feel like this is a great size bag. I feel like this could even be an everyday bag depending on what you carry because you could definitely fit um, like a card holder, um, lipstick, your keys, mirror, um, hand sanitizer. I feel like you can fit a lot in here. It's, pr it's a pretty good size. Like it's not a mini, mini bag like the Tabby 12. It's definitely like a small size bag. Okay, so first off, this is my wallet. This is a compact wallet, but it's my wallet. I'm gonna tell you now, it can fit. But it's going to take up a lot of your room. Um, but, you know, if you're okay with that, then let's just say we'll put a hand sanitizer. We'll put some gum back there. We'll put a rollerball perfume. And let's just say we want to put some keys on top. So, see if that fastened it is kind of like bulky with that being in there but it will fasten just looking at the sides so it will fasten but i wouldn't i wouldn't do that i'm gonna take this wallet out put my card holder in here instead take my keys out get my mirror I always got to keep my Advil with me. Ugh, lip jam. Mini deodorant. Well, it's not going to fit, but if we took this out, it could fit. Let's see. Yep. So your mini deodorant could fit. You still got a mirror. I still got a perfume. I still got a lip gloss. Got card holder. I got my mirror. And some gum and then I could put my keys and it fits so I'm gonna do one more thing Let's take the keys out again <laughs> I'm gonna take the deodorant out um I'm actually gonna put my hand lotion in let's take the mirror out put the hand lotion in let's just put the mirror back here i just put the mirror back there. And then I want to put my medicine in here. And then put my keys on top. And then let's close it. Still no bulk. Still fits. So I showed you a few scenarios of different things that you can carry in there. And this is a combination of things that I carry with me. So all in all, I think this bag is a great bag to have in your bag collection i just love the look of it um i love the functionality of it um like i said this particular color is hard ooh, to find 
I actually got this back off of a seller from Macari. I ordered this and my swinger at the same time. So I got a really great deal. Um, but like I said, you probably can find this on Macari or Poshmark or some other third party site. But the coach website doesn't sell this particular color, but they still have this bag. So thank you so much for tuning into this today's video. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this bag. If you had this bag or you've been thinking about getting this bag, your thoughts on it. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.